Hi again and uh, welcome to the sunshine in my garden. I've now found a sheltered spot, shady spot, so that I can uh, not have to squint at you as I was doing on Friday. Uh, anyway, let's um, look again at a proverb and see how that might apply to us today. Uh, Proverbs 28 and verse 4 says this, Those who forsake instruction praise the wicked, but those who heed it resist them. Uh, God is very clear to us that as his people, we should stay away from the wicked. We should stay away from wickedness. We should have nothing to do with it and stay away from those who try to lead us along paths of unrighteousness and wickedness. Uh, and so Solomon is warning us of this here, that if we um, uh, pay attention to the wicked, then the instruction, the good instruction that God gives us in his word, we will ignore, we will forsake God's instruction and follow the ways of the wicked, those who oppose him and teach against him. And such is the way of fools. Such is the way of those who pay no regard to the one who created us, who made us, who loves us, who gave his son for us. Uh, but instead, those who heed his instruction will resist the wicked. It's not always easy, is it? Sometimes we're tempted, we're pulled in a direction that um, maybe right away we know, but certainly later on we find out is not what he would like, not the way that he would, that God would advise and would seek of us. But, some, but when we do discover that, when we do understand that and realize that, we're to do everything we can to resist the wicked and in turn to return to the uh, sound instruction of God's word. The uh, average Christian in the UK uh, today pays too little regard to scripture. And we need to change that because this is God's word. Uh, it stood the test of time and it's something that people have, have literally died because of. Uh, and so we do well to make sure that we take um, we pay attention to it and we take to heart the instruction that God gives us in his um, trustworthy word. So let's not be among those who forsake his instruction, good instruction. Let's not be among those who follow the wicked, but instead let us be among those who heed God and resist the wicked. Let's pray. Uh, Father, please help us. Help us to be discerning. Help us to be wise during the day ahead of us, Lord. Help us to understand what is from you and what is from the wicked and help us to make that right decision and walk along paths of righteousness for your name's sake. Amen. Bless you. Great to be with you. Uh, thanks for your time. See you soon. Bye.